何<笑> you fool! Zubaba General's effect will use a monster as a spell card, but its effect to boost is not a spell effect. Fool. What's going on my boys, YT Dan back at it again with another Duel Links video. And today is a great day because today is October 14th. The day that that grass looks greener is banned. Sorry Playmaker. Now listen, we're finally gonna be getting in there for game with the new limited and restricted list. I'm for one is extremely excited because we're gonna be bringing back new cards, well, old decks, uh, rather, like Thunder Dragons, because now we have Gold Sarcophagus at two. And since Gold Sarcophagus is at two, I believe that the uh, Thunder Dragon Dark is now at three or unrestricted completely. So now that we have those new cards, new restrictions in, we're gonna actually have a slight nerf on Shir Nui, which honestly mm, kind of is what it is, but Shir Nui is probably still gonna be really good. And then we actually got the hard three lockdown on Alistair. No more Alistair with Cosmic Cyclone, but you're probably gonna catch that hot ass night beam. But we're not here to talk about that right now, my boy. We're here to talk about, you know, Zubaba. We're here to talk about the general. You know, if you wanna save some money on some life points, you need to go ahead and exceed some of the Bubba General and super equip a warrior. This card is really bananas. He was putting in work yesterday on the stream. I was playing my new version of the Stellar Knight combo. Honestly, I really love this deck. I mean, I really want to make this deck work, but I found that, you know, in my playthroughs that pretty much this deck has a very small window it seems to appear in every duel where either if you make a mistake, you will lose, or if your opponent, you know, happens to draw that right card, have a little bit too much of an advantage, maybe um, can surprise you with something from the grave, they can definitely recover. I would say the weakness of this deck is two things. Number one, there is no rank two or not i guess not, not i guess not called rank two there's no exceeds monster that costs two um that is a uh star teller if there was a exceeds level two or rank two that could you could summon that would be actually really good because then it would be easier to use stellar nova but basically in order to use stellar nova you either have to have your delteros on the field or you have to have one of these other Star Teller monsters on the field, and sometimes that can get complicated depending on who you're playing against. Because honestly, let's just be fair. First turn Utopia is ass. That that does not work. It's not a good combo starter. So so what is it about this deck that I like, and why am I playing it? Well, the first thing is it's very easy with the way I've built this deck to go into this uh, Deltaros combo, and I want to say that. The key to making this deck work well, I was having a lot of fun. It's playing this card that no one really plays. Is Star Teller uh, Pro Procreon or Pro Procron or Procron, whatever. This Star Teller monster lets you draw and discard, which is amazing because putting a card in the graveyard is great to set up plays with Altair. And then also um, being able to draw and discard gets to the deck, helps you get to this enemy controller and helps you get to the Star Teller Alpha. So during the live stream, I ran to a lot of problems where, you know, maybe I didn't fully understand a card or a situation or the unique kind of matchup. And I think for this type of deck, it's one of those decks that you have to master the deck and then also have a mastery or knowledge of every single deck that's out there so that you can play accordingly. Because that's the thing about this deck. You really have to know your shit. And when it comes down to the skill, um, I was using Return of the Archduke so that I could use the 10 Archduke. And let me just tell you right now, 10 Archduke was booty. I did not get to get, I didn't get any wins. I didn't get any dubs off 10 Archduke. I did play 10 Archduke one time. Well, no, I played him twice, but the one time I played 10 Archduke, I literally made a mistake because I misread his effect. I thought he put Monster's face down, but he does not. 
he changes them their battle position so like you know ass but anyway 10 archduke is another three cost exceeds monster and at the end of the day i want to just try out 10 archduke i do have a better skill in mind um to run with this uh deck but i'm working with different combos and i think i might have an engine to make this deck work but it's gonna be coming up pretty soon my boy so just for right now rejoice that the ban list has been put into effect skills limit restrict you know no more uh cyberstein not like we were seeing that anymore um you know all kinds of just random nice nerfs which is pretty good is basically going to give star tellers a chance my boy but that's it for me my boys i want you to enjoy the rest of your day enjoy the rest of the stream and as always keep it done Alright, we're gonna summon Vega. Vega's effect. Pro Crytron, whatever his name is. Crytron's effect. Gonna, I discard and got up. Card set. Toshuyo. Yes. This is the power of my Stella Nova. Kaiku the Ghost Destroyer? What? Da Boy. Kaiku the Ghost Destroyer. You maniac. Kaiku the Ghost Destroyer. Son of a bitch. You mother. Kaiku the Ghost Destroyer. I hate you. Summon Kaiku. God damn, man. Shit. You you know that you you know you know you know you're messing with your boy when you got Kaiku the ghost destroyer. Ah. Alright. It's my turn. Da -da. The combos will now commence. Normal summon! Artia! Artia Vega! <laughs> Your dark magic circle has no effect on my combos. Ooh, music's getting spicy. Vega! Vega's effect. Go! Come forth. Denib! Denib's effect. Alt here! Now, prepare yourself. I have many options. With three monsters on the field, I have access to all eight monsters in my extra deck. Now, triple, it sees. Yes! It's Deltaro's time. He's not playing games. Deltaro suffix. Hmm. And I'm going to Hokai. Now, Deltaro's go. Attack Kaiku! Come on, Yugi. Come on. Yugi, show me your power. Dark Magical Circle. Dark Magical Circle. Damn. He's got another Dark Magician. That could only mean one thing. Hmm. I activate my monster's effect. It allows me to special summon a stellar beast from my deck. 
and then its effect will activate. Come forth! Altier! Altier's effect! I get the special summon back a beast from my graveyard. Return! Delgados! Hmm. Da -da. <laughs> My options are limited. I must be careful. Attack position. Card set. <laughs> Normal Shulker. Navigation. It's the Dark Magician. And that other guy. Magic Circle. The need for the Banish. And now it's time to exceed your expectations. Come forth, my beast. Exceed Shokun! Time to face the strength of Zumbaba General. Zubaba the Vic. Zubaba Discard. Zubaba Super Equip. Zubaba, Zubaba, smack it down. Oh, I can't. Oh, yeah, I can't smack it down. Smack that beast. Nani? <laughs> you fool. Zubaba General's effect will use a monster as a spell card, but its effect to boost is not a spell effect. Fool. Take your turn, Yugi. Take your turn. So that my Zubaba General will finish clapping your Zubaba cheeks. Get ready. Zubaba cheek clap time. Prepare. Zubaba cheek clap. What? What are you doing? Did you not learn? Zubaba's effect is a monster effect. Your trap card affects spell cards only. Da -da. Hmm, I can't stellar beast. Can't stellar? That's the wrong card. Stellar Knight Vega. Prepare yourself. Stellar Knight Vega. Ziva Bajinaru. Puny Dark Magician. Can you face the power of my stellar knights? Come on, Zubaba. Come on, Zubaba. Come on, Zubaba! Come on! Come on! Come on! This is the power of my never miss, boy! Damn! Oh no! Oh no! Ah, damn! Not this thing! That's not good. Uh, this this is straight a card too. And uh, oh, and this negate the effect. Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna lose the effect of somebody. Um, I would lose. I'll lose the effect of the nymph because I'm gonna lose the guarantee. Mm. God, I hate this deck. Actually, this would be a nice addition to play that when I get my XC's deck. Uh, extra deck completed. Actually, that'd be a nice plus. Sorry, bro. No easy damage for you this time. Oof. Ah! All right, here we go. Summer. Goblin bug. Nope. All right. And um, I'll be conservative. Yep. Alright. 
What do we have? At least we got one back row. Uh, You gotta be careful. Cause I don't know if he's got the barrel in his hand. And if he does, I gotta have something to back me up. So I gotta bring out Deltros. And we're gonna send uh, a Deneb. We're gonna pop his back row. Nice. Okay, that was a good pop. And then we're gonna get this chick off the fucking field. Negate the damage. All right, good. All right, we're back in the game. He said, why don't I play the trap that gives the extra summon? I mean, honestly, the trap is a little too slow for how I'm playing the deck. Like it's basically constantly going off of having additional monsters uh, in the, watch me get, hold on a second. Who went in the grave again? It was the nib and it was the other one. So I can grab. Okay. So I can grab you. And we're gonna summon. Watch out for that defense. Activate. And we're gonna activate. And summon. We're gonna activate. And then we are going to. Did I search for the nib this turn? Um, he summoned. He blew me up. He killed all my stuff. Uh, no, I didn't search for the nip, so bring back the nip. The nip, activate, and search your deck, and grab. All right, I have you in my lock now. I'm gonna tap your jammy jams. Gonna be night night time soon? Hope so. Plan on destroying me? Well, let me give you Bubba. Keep fucking around, I'll give you a bubba. Dodo. Bah. Oh! <laughs> oh! Here we go. Here we go. All right. Uh, first. First off, uh, I'm gonna hit. Uh, first off, I'm gonna hit this. Uh, hit this cowboy. First off, hit this cowboy. I'm a rhinestone cowboy. I'm a rhinestone cowboy. And then the summon the neb. Use the neb's effect. Uh, take this little card down. I'm gonna go ahead and hit this up real quick. Big boy Zubaba. Big big boy Zubaba's effect. Put his nib on him. I'm coming over with Zubaba. Zubaba. Hmm. Better. <laughs> Cowboys are picked. Cardo Seto. Pricon. <laughs> Cardo Set. My Cowboys ready to battle. Get him, cowboy! 
Noni. Bastard. You top deck that. You animal. Damn. 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 Says so once per turn during the battle phase, he can toss three coins. Toss them coins, mother. Toss them coins, you piece. No! You got one coin? Lucky bastard. Lucky bastard. You lucky bastard. You lucky bastard. You lucky bastard. No, no, I will not let you. No, 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 I refuse. I refuse. Now come over here. You get over here. Get over here. You writing those blank checks. Get over here. Boy, boy I'm a duddo. It's not over yet. It's, it's not over. It's not over. No, no, where you going? Maniac. Maniac. I mean, honestly, in my mind, I just was thinking like, why else would he be three monsters? Why, why else would he cost three monsters? What, he can only just change battle position? That's actually super, that's actually super booty. So, yeah. <laughs> you said CBD oil is good. <laughs> I messed up. I misread it. My excitement. I, now that is something that happens to me back. Well, that used to happen to me a lot back in the day when I first started playing Yu-Gi-Oh. I would get so excited about a new card and read the effect real fast and think it does something that it doesn't do and be like, this deck is broken. Look at all this crazy shit it can do. And then somebody be like, bruh, it don't work like that. And I'd be like, really? And it's like, nah, bruh. And I'm like, oh man. Oh, this is annoying. Right off rip, fucking cockatiss. Turn one cockatiss, man? No. I think I'm gonna put a, a lava golem in this deck. I mean, honestly, I think a lava golem would just be so clutch in here. Lava Golem and some Kite Roy or something. Dud-o. Fucking Cockatus, bro. I don't think I have anything for a Cockatus except for, you know, <laughs> the, the Cockatus, you know what I'm saying? That's all I got for the Cockatus right now. Um, He can go up to 3,900. Let's summon. Um, no. Let's set two face down and pass turn. Cockatiss, man. He better not draw that red fortune fairy. Fuck it, he can do that shit. He's <laughs> so mad. <laughs> like, all right, disconnect now. All right, disconnecting. Um, yeah, we're gonna actually. Do I really need to negate that? I guess I don't. What's this one do again? Oh, he adds a card. Yeah, I'll negate that. I guess. Oh no, I, that does. Oh, that's fucking game anyway. It's thirty nine. It's thirty nine hundred. Well, actually, yeah, maybe he'll, maybe he will swing in and boost. Cause he got 39, it's not 4,000. I have a hundred of those things left. Oh no, 28, sorry, triple. All right, now we've got some moves. Actually, let me see this thing. Yeah, and it, does, and it targets too, man, that's, Really bad. I thought you were cool, Archduke. I thought you were pretty nice. But you're actually 
pretty ass. <laughs> Arch Archduke Bootman. Uh, let's see what we're gonna do. We're gonna summon. We're gonna Goblin Boyg. Goblin boy, goblin boy, boy. Yeah, it's gonna put him in defense and I zuba zuba. Yeah. Goblin boy, goblin boy. Gotta give him that big zumba. Zuba 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 <sighs> Here we go Let's make The Zuba General Let's make that boy pick Zuba time, boy. It's time to get Zubaba on you, boy. It's Zubaba time. Zubaba don't play no games with you. Zubaba equip. A Zubaba smack. A Zubaba strike. Yeah. This is the power of Zubaba. Zubaba going to come over there. Zubaba attacking your beast. This is how we do the Zubaba. Get him, Zubaba. Why are you running? Why are you running? <laughs> Hurry up. Thank you. Zubaba crush your monster. Come on. He can't, I can't cowboy for game right now. I definitely cowboy for game if I could. <laughs> but I don't have it. I learned my lesson from trying to prevent these guys from hitting invocation. I am no longer going to be clever and try to econ take and do all that shit. Because they always have a second one. No matter what. So we're just going to wait until battle phase to see what the Fuck he does. Yeah. Invo doll. Can't put it back in my deck. Grab Alistair add to hand. All right, dog. Purgatorio's time to battle. Attack my Purgatorian beast. All right. Enemy controller. <laughs> Commando unit. Bring that ass to me, boy. To me, hey, all right, draw. Your purgatorio may be strong and powerful and big and thick, but he's no match to the power of the bubble. So, I'm activating the bubble's effect, moving a material to equip to the bubble. Now the general is stronger. For great auto rates online, go to Zubaba General and save some time. Attack my Zubaba. 52 of those things on your invoked beast. That's right. There's not a single invocation you can make to wipe out the power of Zubaba. You're through. My Zubaba General's about to run wild on you. That's right. You can't invocation Alistair past Zubaba. Nani? Invocation? For what though? Just a content. Kaliga. Kali. Dado. With that card, only one monster can attack. But if it's destroyed, then multiple can run mucks on your life points. Do I take the chance? It says if a player attempts to attempts to activate 
None of the player's monsters can activate their effects the rest of the turn while this card is visible on the field. Each player can only attack with one monster. But if your monster is destroyed, then your life points will be rend. No. The time has come for battle. Zubaba Generate. Zubaba Strike. Up here! Mmm, satisfaction! This is the power of Zubaba. Different Dimension Demons Conquerors and Kings of the Different Dimension The Triple D were banished from the metagame and cast out into the shadows for all time. Ignored by the tier list 